Well, I'm back everybody, back here in Arizona. And uh, it's kind of an experience driving my bike all the way up through New Mexico. I was gonna head to Colorado Springs, but I got stuck in Santa Fe. My the sprocket on my bike uh, just got worn out so bad from the trip. It's actually a little bit worn out before then and I should have I replaced it. Uh, but you know, you put things off and that's what happened, so. Um, I spent a couple days in Santa Fe and drove all the way back through down uh, New Mexico looking for property and uh, trying to get some leads on property and it's just it's just a real tough thing there I mean the whole issue there is about water you know they have they have some real water issues in, in New Mexico and and that's gonna be the challenge when I find something um, anyway back to this so let me walk inside here, give you guys a glimpse of what I'm doing. Here you see the floor. Well, first of all, you the walls and everything. You can see that they're pretty much gutted. Um, you see the metal there along the walls. The thing I like about this trailer are all the windows. I think it's really cool. And you see on the roof here there's a lot of insulation that I still have to take out. I'm going to replace this insulation with this styrofoam. Should be a better insulator. It's going to be lighter. And that's that's an issue, you know, when you're when you're traveling and pulling in this thing, you don't want this trailer to be too heavy. So anyway, the heat pretty much you know, these tiles just come right up because it's so hot here in Arizona. I think the glue is just pretty much just done for. <laughs> so I'm pulling this up and what I'm seeing is that the floor is all warped and so I'm going to have to replace all the plywood underneath and I'll probably do that next week when I when I get some cash and I'm able to buy the wood that I need. Um, I'm probably going to have to take these panels out because I want to run wire throughout the whole thing for some outlets and and for a new AC unit that I have, I've got to buy uh, when, I ins when I install the solar. So that's where I'm at now guys and I think this is going to be a really cool project. It's, I'm, I'm excited about it so I will talk to you guys later.